Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your daily general message for Wednesday, June 24th, 2020. Uh, please keep in mind that this is a general reading and let's get started here. What I did was I pulled a 10 card spread as always. I pulled the last card I pulled a clarifier for as well as an outcome and two clarifiers. So let's get started, whomever this is meant for. There's two different energies is what I'm picking up. I'm saying male energy is because the King of Wands himself uh, is showing up on the top row as well as right underneath is the queen of cups so you could be you could be dealing with fire here uh, as well as water okay but it's really about the energy of it taking action with that one energy so let's get started here you got the this is the male energy eight of wands that's fast movement fast communication in regards to a, uh, a decision that is going to be made i feel with the two of pentacles literally turn looking at that Ten of Cups. So that fulfillment of love here that I feel that this dude, regardless if he's fire or not, uh, is going to make a choice, a decision. It's kind of like a, I always call it like an Oprah aha moment where it just kind of comes to you out of nowhere and it's going to be fast. All right. Fast movement in regards to a decision to be made because in the back of their head, they want a new start with this person. Okay. With the fool here. And if you take notice, they're all looking, even this dude here with the two of pentacles is all focused on completion of love. Uh, it's going to come in quickly, the decision and action being taken place in regards to whatever that they have been thinking about in regards to a new beginning here. And that's that action. All right. So totally different energy in regards to the feminine energy. Uh, she starts off with the five of cups. So this five is known for that change in regards to love. All right. And they've calmed their mind. All right. They've kind of gotten their balance back in. I feel, uh, you know, they do think about them as well. That five of cups is known for that missing energy as well in regards to the past love here. Uh, because I also feel that they don't really know what's going to take place all right the queen of cups does represent water like i said but she loves this person but she's looking she's not even looking up you know she's focused on that one cup here wanting that new start of love but you know in reality she's facing that moon so she doesn't really know where she stands all right uh and in the back of her head she wants work put in all right with the three of pentacles here in regards to a relationship but i feel that this chicka here all right this queen of cups energy here in regards to this relationship she feels that nope there's not going to be any work it's kind of like a discouraging energy is what i'm feeling it's kind of like you know this is never going to happen i really miss this person i've calmed my mind i think about this person but i don't really think that this person is ever going to show up you know in the dark about things but still focused on that new start you know it's it's back and forth it's kind of very confusing it's almost like the five of swords energy going back and forth back and forth constantly in their head here so i feel that in the back of their mind they want this work put in but they also feel that it's never going to happen okay is what i'm feeling meanwhile back on the ranch the dude and the full card the dude the two of pentacles and the eight of wands is all facing that center energy of the ten of cups so this person i feel is going to make a very quick decision the male energy is what i'm picking up uh in regards to getting that fulfillment here because in the back of their head exactly they just want to take that next step in regards to the full energy and now they're going to make it's kind of like i want this new beginning and all of a sudden it's just going to hit them and they're going to take action here because here's the two of wands being the outcome and it's actually facing the past so there is going to be a decision made there was this cutoff of communication but there's going to be this movement now in regards to that communication to get the nine of cups which is their wish fulfillment so bottom line is this, don't be discouraged. I know easier said than done, right? Have that positive outlook. Keep having that calmness in regards to the mind with that four of swords here. Keep meditating, keep manifesting for their return, okay? Uh, you, may, you may not see this action coming in, especially with the moon here and the eight of wands, okay? It's gonna be fast movement, I feel. But I feel a little bit discouragement in regards to this relationship is not going to be put work into. You can't think like that. You got to more so think more positively, I feel, and calm the mind, heal the mind. Because even though you miss this person, the five is known for that change. And that's what's going to take place. So that is what I have. I hope that this helps, guys. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't already. Also click that bell on the side to get updated information. You guys rock. Stay strong. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.